Welcome back. In this video I will do an experiment with Chinese padlocks. Stay until the end of the video and find out what are the weaknesses of Chinese padlocks. For this experiment we will need rebar pliers and a Chinese padlock. This padlock doesn't stand a chance. The pliers will cut them with ease. This happens because when we hit the padlock from the side, the spring goes back and the beak of the padlock automatically jumps up. This is such a simple method that it won't take you more than 3 seconds to open the lock without any hassle. I'll squeeze the padlock down. Then push the beak with the tip of the knife and the padlock will open. I will make the letter T out of this jar lid. Then I'll push the tip into the small opening between the padlock and turn it 360 degrees to open the padlock. This method is the most reliable and will not damage your padlock. I hope you learned something from this video and don't buy cheap padlocks. Thanks for watching the video.